Hey everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you're new here, hi, my name is Shabona. Please do consider subscribing if you like what you see. If you are a returning subscriber, hey, welcome back. So in today's video, I'm going to be answering those questions that you guys asked me off of my Instagram. Now, if you don't follow me on Instagram, you can do that by hitting a link or checking it out. I'll put, I'll put something up here so that you can get in contact with me. So let's just get into the video. Um, when did I get my braces on? I got my braces done um, during the first week of August of this year. So it's been four months now. How soon did you feel? How soon after you got them did you feel pressure or aching? I didn't feel pressure. I didn't feel aching. What I felt most was very uncomfortable because it literally feels like you have um, a double set of teeth in your mouth. And I couldn't talk, I couldn't eat, like I, I was just really uncomfortable. So I just kept quiet and I went to sleep. Cause I guess you just need time to get used to it. Cause now I'm just like, I forget I even have the braces. Cause it's like, it's very normal now, it's very normal. On a scale of one to 10, 10 being the worst, how bad was the pain for you? Um, the pain wasn't bad and it still isn't bad. I think I'll give it a two because look, I, I'm very immune to pain and um, yeah, so I guess that is why and um, I think the most uncomfortable thing and the most pain is from the metal rubbing against my skin in my mouth and then bruising it because obviously it's pokey, it's gonna hurt my mouth. So that kind of bruises like, you know when you bite onto your skin by mistake and you're eating or whatnot, that's how it feels. Like, there's a whole lot of like ulcers here and here because of that and especially in the back because there's molars in the back and the molars... Um, kind of hold the braces into place and the wire so that kind of has a lot of things going on in the back so it hurts a lot here and gets bruised a lot here what kind of food did you eat when i first got my braces so i ate mash and gravy rice i think yeah i had soup because um you can't really bite and i still don't bite a lot with my braces it just doesn't feel nice and also if you bite a lot with your braces you could um, ruin your braces or break a wire or wrap it off so just kind of avoid it if you can and also your, your teeth really don't function when you have braces they just they're just useless so don't bite just don't bite you would rather eat soft food like potato and mash and vegetables i eat a lot of vegetables on a daily so it doesn't really matter to me like i don't eat red meat um so it was a it was a kind of a win-win situation with me I didn't, I didn't miss out on, on much, even till today. <laughs> How often do I get them tightened? Okay, so I spoke to people that have braces and had braces and they say that it's either, some people say that their tightening is when they get new colors, like the bands, and then some say it's when they change their wires. Now I haven't changed my wire yet, but I did get bands, so I think every month, because I get new bands every month, so probably that. Do I wear rubber bands? No. Rubber bands basically um, correct your overbite or your underbite and I don't really have a problem with my bite so I don't need rubber bands and my dentist said that he that I don't need bands for my whole braces journey. How many times a day do you brush your teeth? Do you have any tips to prevent the white squares on your teeth? Okay so I usually if I'm at home I brush every time I'm done eating. But when I'm out, when I'm working, or if I'm going out, then I brush in the morning, and then when I come home from work. The white squares, I don't know guys, like don't even think about it. The white squares are basically, if you don't know, when the braces do come off, obviously the teeth surface that are under the braces have not seen daylight. So they're gonna be like shining and whatnot. I think just go for a cleaning and go for a whitening. That's all I can tell you. Other than that, I don't know. Um, did you get to pick your colors? Yeah, I pick my colors every month. So my dentist is really cool. So he plays around like this month I had pink and then I have red in the bottoms because we were like um, trying to see what we're gonna do for Christmas. So yeah, I, I had gray the first time because I was a bit skeptical about the colors and I had purple, blue, this is pink, now I'm gonna get red. How long do you have your braces for? So my duration is signed off for 14 months. And it's been four months now and he said that i might get my braces off in january which is kind of shocking because my teeth have moved drastically 
and it's kind of sad too because I am really enjoying my braces. But yeah, so it might it might end soon, guys. It might end soon. Do I need jaw surgery? No, I don't need jaw surgery. I don't even know what that means. Why? Why? What kind of toothbrush do I use? And um, appliances. Okay, so I use uh, an electric toothbrush, and then I have um, these. Let me bring it and I'll show you. So I bought these from the skim. Basically, I don't know what they're called, but um, I don't know if you can see it. I'll probably put up a picture. Yeah, I'll put up a picture. So basically, these go in between your braces to clean them. Like you can take this to go out, or if you brush and you can still see like stains in your mouth, or like food in your mouth. Sorry, goes in between, and you can clean whatever is still stuck. Basically, then I use floss, but I don't really floss a lot. It's really it's it's too much and it's too hard. So my dentist said I don't have to because I brush really well. So I think the best thing is get an electric toothbrush, and then you can mouthwash and what else? Yeah, that's about it, guys. That's about it. Do I use wax? Yes, I do. You use wax. So wax is basically they give it to you for your braces to put it. It's like it's like bubble gum, but not bubble gum, and it goes here it goes over your your braces your brackets or your wire if it, it it basically prevents your braces from bruising your mouth how long did your braces take to put on my braces took a long time oh my god i was so sleepy and i was so hungry i think it took over an hour because i did a cleaning before putting on my braces so it did take a good couple of minutes yeah i did but the process was really nice because like i said my dentist is, is he's he's the bomb.com guys i'm telling you he had music playing he was talking he even said that if you um need a break because they basically put this instrument in your mouth to open it so that they can work in your mouth and it hurts your cheeks a lot so he said when you're tired and you feel pain just tell us we'll take it out we can relax so well so i was really like comfortable in it but it did take a long time what kind of braces do you have? I have traditional braces and I know you can get Invisalign and retainers. I did have retainers a while back but it didn't work for me. So I just have traditional braces. Oh, and Invisalign is basically ceramic clear braces. And uh, they, they're really expensive though. So yeah. What's the best part of our braces? I think it has to be... There's a new conversation that I didn't experience ever and not many people have braces so the conversation is like it's unique and I get to explain to people and I get to motivate them if they do want to get braces and um, I guess it's a conversation starter and also the process is very exciting to watch like when you take your pictures of your teeth every week and you say yo look at this how it changed and then getting your colors it's very exciting it's like being pregnant I promise you not that I would know but the worst part about braces probably eating because i cannot eat a lot of things and also the cleaning process because i know when i go out i can't have fun because i can't eat whatever i want and also i have to be cautious of what i'm eating because of it staying in my mouth or food getting stuck in my mouth i remember the one time i walked around Oshaka. thank god for masks oh my god and there was like lettuce stuck in here and i was like damn okay cool it's life it's life but yeah there's not much pain, so that can't be your worst part. What question are you asked the most about your braces? Does it hurt? And also, why did I get it so late? Does it hurt? No. And why did I get it so late? When I was young, I didn't want braces. I think every child doesn't want braces because they know they're going to get teased or made fun of anything of that sort. And also finances. But the funny thing is that I still, up till today, didn't have the proper finances because I'm not on medical aid. So we play, we pay in cash. And even now people are like, why did you get your braces in 2020 during a pandemic? And I was like, look, God's timing over my timing. I don't know. It's not like we're raining money in here, but we did get it. Do I ever get the metal taste in my mouth? Mm, not really. I do get the rubbery taste, I guess. But not the metal taste. Where did I get my braces done? So I got my braces done by Dr. Ziad in Musgrave. It's called Musgrave Dental Studios. Oh, I just love going there because 
I don't know the personal service you get from them is just top notch. I think I'm most sad about ending my braces journey because I know I'm not gonna see him anymore. He has Spotify playing. He's telling you jokes. It's just oh, it's too good. It's too good, guys. Okay, so this is the end of the video. Thank you so much for watching. If you've come this far and you haven't subscribed, I honestly don't know what you're waiting for. And if you haven't liked this video too, I honestly don't know what you're waiting for. Get in touch with me, guys, on my Instagram. That is at Rosen by Nona. If you have any questions about my braces or anything else in general, comment down below or get in touch with me on my Instagram. I really don't mind at all. I'm ready to help. And um, yeah, any other braces videos that you want to see, just leave it down in the comments or message me and I will totally take it into consideration. See you in my next video. Bye!